Well, Bernie's out there trying to sell socialism as something that it isn't. This is Bill Valentine. Two minutes of truth, dead ahead. Bernie Sanders was at a town hall meeting on Fox News when he was asked a question from the audience by a young lady who was born in Russia. As someone from Russia, a country that was greatly impacted by the negative effects of socialism, what assurances can you offer myself and other people impacted by socialism that democratic socialism will not have the same results? Mm, good question. <laughs> uh, well, Bernie, of course, talked about how the Soviet Union was not really socialism. It's uh, communism and gulags and all that stuff. And then he launched into the big lie that he's talking about Scandinavian socialism. So when we talk about democratic socialism, I'm talking about Finland, I'm talking about Denmark, I'm talking about Sweden, I'm talking about countries all over the world who have used their government to try to improve life for working families, not just the people on top. The Scandinavian countries hated when people like Bernie try to paint them as socialists. Here's the president of Denmark several years ago speaking at Harvard. I know that uh, some people in, in the U.S. associate the Nordic model with some sort of socialism. Therefore, I would like to make one thing clear. Uh, Denmark is uh, far from a socialist plant economy. Denmark is a market economy. See, this is the soft sell of socialism. They want you to think the police, the fire department, the libraries are all socialism. They want you to think that all these wonderful Scandinavian countries are socialist. None of that's true. But if you can sucker folks into believing that that's socialism then maybe they won't notice so much when you start dismantling every one of their rights one by one. People often ask me, what's the difference between communism and socialism? The firing squad. <laughs>